Alright, and this is, the, uh, we got here a... Uh, that's a primer pump, which primes the float. It actually has a float that functions. Huh. Oh yeah, look at that. And it's going up, it's starting to fill up. And what is it called? What? Flat what? It's a flat four. Flat, a flat four. four cylinder. Yeah, oh, yeah. it's kind of like a Volkswagen. Yeah, engine. look at the, the yeah, yeah post cylinder. Post cylinder. Okay. And this, this is, is completely the, made by hand. Like everything. Every scratch, everything. Yeah. Every except single for piece. The, except for the bolts and some right, nuts right. and springs. You know, right. And the ignition. Mm -hmm. But uh, I did make the switch for the ignition. Okay, let me get out of your way. Overhead exhaust. Look at that. First, first pull. Well, you didn't see it in fine tuna, but still. Yeah, Pretty usually cool. she likes to start up with a little bit of a rock, you know. To get things There we go. Tank made the fist, this comes out. Yeah, that's where the ignition is. It's uh, two SS ignition uh, uh, modules. They fire on the waste cylinder, so you got one operating uh, this pair of cylinders, the other one operating that pair of cylinders. So that's why you have two magnetic pickups and one magnet on the wheel. Right.
Can you make it go, Brian? That's about it. You know, yeah. you know, it's gonna want to die out. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do a little gargle. Yeah. That little pop pop. Yeah, no, that's pretty cool.
good. There you go. Oh well. That was a good run. That was good. What'd you say you used for the push rods? I remember you told me that. Uh, knitting needles. Knitting needles. Knitting yeah. Needles. Okay. yeah, knitting needles. They come in all different sizes, you know? So I picked the size that I like. They were already come anodized, so I didn't have to do any of that. Just to make sure I was careful not to scratch the anodizing off when I grabbed it in the lathe and whatnot, you know? Hey, Brian, it's a good thing you do good finish work on your engines because if you put a, a not so well finished engine on a box that nice, it would draw the eye right away to the well, box. Well, yeah, it's all that, it's, everything is attention that, to detail, you know. Yeah, that's great, though. Dude. Thank you. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm glad you enjoyed Magnificent. Pretty cool, Brian. It's my show winner for this year. Yeah. One of my favorite models. Yeah. The other yeah, one, I got a lot of prototype work on yeah. And it paid off with this, yeah. you know. Put your hand up yeah, there, Mike. So little, we'll see what size uh, that is. Combustion chamber design. Turn your hand sideways, Mike. It's, it's, it's almost the same size as the whole engine. Yeah, it yeah. worked well on the uh, on, on That's the incredible. Board, so That's really well, nice. Why not yeah. try it on this motor? And, mm -hmm. and, uh, it's a opposed four-cylinder boxer engine. All hand-built from scratch. That's the size of your hand.